All right, guys, uh, before we start with the uh, performance test between these two devices, uh, I just wanted to show you guys a uh, comparison side by side as far as the uh, thickness and all that. Uh, this tablet is absolutely uh, crazy thin, like probably the thinnest tablet ever. Uh, take a look at that, you know, next to the Samsung Galaxy S6, uh, the tablet is way, way thinner. Take a look at the speakers on the bottom. You can tell they are family. Now the one thing that I don't understand is why they put the uh, USB port kind of like on the side and not right in the middle like they always do. Uh, not that th that 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 affects anything, but I don't know why. And take a look at the cameras. Uh, we have a 60 megapixel here on the uh, S6, uh, 8 megapixel here on the camera. In case you're wondering, these uh, little dots right here, it's uh, probably to connect a Bluetooth uh, keyboard. But as you guys can see, uh, yeah, the tablet is actually thinner. So let's uh, go ahead and start with the uh, benchmarking test. All right, before we start with the test, I just wanna show you guys uh, quick here that both phones are gonna be running in the high performance mode. So as you guys can see right there, power saving mode here in the Galaxy S6, it's uh, turned off. Uh, let's uh, take a look here quick. Uh, power saving mode, it's off. So both tablets are gonna be running in the high performance mode. Let's go ahead and close all the applications that we have opened right now and let's start with the first test. All right, looks like we got the uh, results now for the uh, quadrant test. Let's uh, go ahead and take a look here. And let's start with the uh, S6. So the S6, uh, we got a uh, 34,000 or 35,452 points uh, here on the tablet, 27,994. Let's go to the next test. So the next one is uh, Anturu. And as you guys can see, because of the 64-bit uh, operating system here on the uh, S6, we have to enable this. All right, let's start with the test. All right, we got the uh, result for the Anturu on the uh, S6. Uh, we have a score of uh, 65,084 points. Uh, on the uh, tablet, uh, the score is 51,555 points. Let's go to the next uh, test. All right, the next test, the next uh, benchmarking test is called GFX Bench OpenGL. Let's start all right on both. All right, guys, so we got some results here. I'm not gonna read all of these. Uh, feel free to pause the video and go through the scores if you want to. But just to give you an idea, for example, the test called Manhattan, uh, the S6 score 872.7 frames uh, and 14 frames per second. Uh, the uh, tablet for 69.8 and 7.6. Uh, this one right here, T-Rex 2072, uh, right here was uh, 2490 points and feel free to uh, like I said pause the video and go through these uh, scores if you want to let's go to the last test so the last test is a 3d mark now let's go ahead and open here 
Okay, we're gonna start with the test now. Okay, we got some uh, results here. Uh, 1,223 points on the S6, uh, 710 points on the tablet. Uh, we got a message right here that says, hey, sorry, we don't have yet uh, uh, enough data uh, to compare scores for this uh, device. And this one right here says, good news. This is one of the most powerful devices around and everything seems to be working normally. All right, guys, so there you have it, the performance test comparison between the Galaxy Tab S2 and the Galaxy S6. I wasn't expecting the tablet to be the same than the phone. I knew for a fact that this phone is the most powerful device available right now. But hey, the, the scores and the results that we got from the tablet were pretty amazing. So there you have it. Thanks for watching, guys. Subscribe for more videos, and we'll see you later.